Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztofa Staszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax deductible donation to support our students, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ASU actuary. Here's a problem for today, for exam LTAN. You are given that the force of interest is 6% at any time, and the force of mortality is 1% at any age, um, starting from age x. So uh, for a person at age x, uh, force of mortality for future ages is 1%. Y is the present value running variable for a continuous annuity of 1 per year, payable for the lifetime of X with 10 years certain. Calculate the probability that Y is greater than E of Y. Well, let's calculate E of Y first. So E of Y is, has a 10 years certain period, and then the present value of that is a bar angle 10, and then deferred by 10 years with uh, consideration for both uh, force of interest and force of mortality, the deferral is accounted for by the pure endowment uh, present value um, factor, which is e to the minus 0.06 times 10 times e to the minus 0.01 times 10 uh, times a bar x plus 10. And of course, we know the formula for a angle 10 at uh, force of interest 6%, that's 1 minus e to the minus 0.06 times 10 over 0.06, um, and the uh, pure endowment factor accounting for deferral um, under these circumstances is equal to e to the minus 0.7, and, the, and a bar x uh, plus 10 um, is 1 over mu plus delta, because both mu and delta are constant, which is 1 over, um, actually, delta plus mu, the way it's written, is uh, 0.06 plus 0.01, and that's approximately 14.6138818. And the probability that y is more than e of y is the probability that y is more than this number that we just calculated, which is 14.6138182. That's the same as the probability that uh, 1 minus e to the minus 0.06 over 0.06 is greater than that number. And we solve this inequality for t. That's the same as the probability that t is more than the natural logarithm of 1 minus 0.06 times 14.6138183 divided by negative 0.06. And we calculate that number, and it's approximately probability that t is greater than 34.935565. Uh, but we are in the constant force of mortality world with the force equal to 1%. So this probability, it's the probability of survival for this many years, it, that's just e to the minus mu times t, with the little t value being 34.9035565. So this is e to the minus 0.01 times 34.9035565. And that's approximately 0 0.7053608843, uh, which is answer A. Please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem itself belongs to the Society of Actuaries. The solution is mine. Good luck in your studies and good luck on the test.